Hello guys, welcome back to another video. And here we have received a new update from DJI. That is DJI Flap version 1.6.9. Is when you open the DJI Flap, you will get a update notification. And if you ask me what's new here, uh, the DJI has fixed few bugs, but those bugs are not for DJI Mini 2. Uh, those are particularly for the Mini 3. In the about session, the app version, the currently app version that we were using was 1.6.8. So if you haven't received any notification of the update, then you can go to the official website of the DJI and from here you can download the DJI Fly app version 1.6.9. The download has been completed and I will click on update and our DJI Fly app will start getting updated. So in this video, we will also be checking out uh, the free hack that we have that is Rainbow app. We will check out whether it's working or not and we will also be checking the DH companion and we will also be checking if there is any additional feature or any uh, thing that we can observe with this particular version of DJI Flap. So guys here in the safety settings you can see that our max altitude is at 15 meters as always. So in the about session uh, you can see that our app version is 1.6.9 and our aircraft firmware version is 1.05. We have updated our aircraft firmware and FlySafe database, everything is up to date. And whenever you update your DJI flap, I would suggest you guys to go to the advanced safety settings and in the signal lost, you need to select it to RTH. So sometimes whenever you update your DJI flap, it will be auto reset to hover. So I recommend you to go and change it to RTH. So when we see other settings like controls, camera, transmission, everything is same as we had in the previous version. So we don't see any uh, difference in this particular version. Now guys let's open the DH companion and see whether we will be able to bypass the 15 meters limit or not. So when we open the DH companion we would require a internet connection for on our phone and uh, the DH companion only works on android application. And we have the detailed video on the DH companion on this channel I will be adding the link in the description. So once we hit on the 500 meters NFCC we need to open back our DJI Fly app. So here in the safety settings, uh, the max altitude has been set to 500 meters. So that means DH companion is working totally fine. Now we will just close our DJI flap and reopen it. So whenever we close and reopen our DJI flap, as you all know that our max altitude will be set back to 15 meters. So this time we will be checking uh, whether the rainbow app, free version of rainbow app will be able to hack our 15 meters or not. When you download your rainbow application, free version rainbow application, you need to unplug and plug your cable. And here, once your rainbow application is connected, you need to go to the settings and set your max altitude to 500 meters. So I'll not be explaining in detail about the hack in this video because I have made a, a separate video for iOS and Android uh, explaining the complete detailed process of uh, following the steps to bypass this 15 meters. So now, as you can see on the screen, in the safety settings, max altitude is set to 500 meters. That means DH companion rainbow application are working totally fine. Guys, I have also tested the same thing with the Lychee application. Lychee application is also working fine. So as you can see on the screen, we are able to fly our drone more than 15 meters. So I would recommend you guys to use the free version of uh, Rainbow application and reset your 15 meters. So it does not need even internet connection. If you ask me what is the fix that we found in this version of 1.6.9. So I tried quick shots and previously few people were not finding the tracking box when we enter into the quick shots so now that issue has been fixed previously uh, we used to only get the uh, tracking box when we were close to the object now that issue has been fixed and even at the longer distance we are able to track the object so all the quick shots are working totally fine i tried the quick shots and uh, even rth is working fine and i have also tested the panorama mode or wide angle photo that is also working fine and stitching is more uh, accurate than the previous version. So guys, I would suggest you to update your DJI flap to version 1.6.9. 1.6.9 is working very stably and you will be able to follow the hack process and you can reset your 15 meters without any issue. So that's it for this video guys. I hope you have liked this video and found this video informative. If you guys found this video informative, do hit a like button and subscribe to the channel. We'll meet in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.